For four decades, union workers maintained the grounds at Forest Lawn Cemetery. That changed in September 2021, when a vote was held to decertify the election. Those who lost their jobs claim that workers were hired with the intention of decertifying the election. By Joe Dispenza, the president of Forest Lawn, who's been on administrative leave since June, and Craig Walcott, who is currently the acting president, but was superintendent of grounds at the time. Forest Lawn trustees said in a statement that there was nothing improper, that the election was held under the auspices of the National Labor Relations Board and not challenged by Teamsters Local 449. They also say that West New York Cemetery Services, a company that's done some of the work since the union left, that was founded by Walcott and is run by a son of Walcott's, was chosen because they were efficient and produced cost savings for the cemetery. Another son also owns a roofing company that has been working at Forest Lawn of Walcott. So altogether, Walcott and Walcott family-owned businesses earned slightly over a million dollars in 2021. Western York Cemetery Services in 2020 and 2021 together also earned over a million dollars.